know what this is? What? This is our gold pay anniversary. Oh Lord. <laughs> All right, y'all, it is our anniversary today and we are taking the day off and we are gonna go gold panning and we're gonna bring y'all with us. Yay! Keep making you stuff, we're never gonna get there, huh? Well, it's your day, you can do whatever you want. Okay, well, I guess when you get to the top of the mountain, uh, you can't see anything anymore. Holy buckets, dude. <laughs> mist is moving so fast. I don't know if you guys can see it or not. It's crazy. Okay. Do you know what this is? I found I a little piece of chaga in my backpack. Terrified. It's a little piece of chaga. Where did we get that? I don't know. Okay. So that's Here. chaga. Chaga <laughs> mushrooms with Nobody. dog hair on it. <laughs> Okay, we drove up the mountain that we live on and down the other side. Uh, we're at the place that we like to go gold panning, one of the many places. Yeah. We need our armor. Um, I only use 7% DEET armor because I don't like it on my skin. But Mr. Reeve uses the real stuff, 25%. That's really the best kind for going through the woods. So I'll just bite off those mosquitoes because I don't want that 25% on my skin. It makes my lips go numb. She doesn't like DEET on her skin. I don't like mosquitoes on my skin. Fair enough. <laughs> and now you know why we wear mosquito repellent. <laughs> Whoop. Okay, let's put this in here because it wears off easy. We need it again. That's why you should use the real stuff. No, I don't like the real stuff. I like to be able to, you know, feel my lips for the next day. Yes, yeah, so you can talk back to me. What? Yeah, if your lips are numb, you can't talk back. Oh, I can talk back with, I can talk back to you, lip numbs or not. Lip numbs. Lip numbs? Yeah, me. Yeah. You know what I meant. <laughs> if you leave the tripod out, you can whack a bear with it. Yeah, that's going to work. Well, you might have to hit him twice. Yeah. <laughs> Do you have the keys? I have, yeah. Okay. What do you need? My fancy gloves. Your fancy gloves? Yeah. Oh, I need gloves too. Yeah. Gloves? Check. You got gloves? Yep. In your pocket? Yep, in my pocket. All right, let's go. You got keys. I got keys in case our keys take a drink. No, not Maybe our keys take a drink. We only want one oh, key I don't. to take oh, a I drink. Oh, I do have it. Okay, good. Okay. All right. Cool, we had to check on my pockets. Ready? Excited? Yeah. Lead the way, fearless leader. I don't know where I'm going. You still with me? Absolutely. You're too quiet. I don't trust what's going on back there. What? <laughs> Rude. Rude, but truthful. Oh, I see. <laughs> Thanks for carrying all this stuff. Yeah, how did this happen? 
Because you're always nice. You had me. a bucket a second ago, I thought. No. <laughs> no, look, see, it's in your hand. I don't have a bucket. You're Trixie. You gonna spy us a good spot? Yeah, I'm gonna spy us a good spot. Look what? it. Remember? What? Oh, hey. Remember we the big rock? Before. I told you, this is where you sprayed yourself with the gold pan and the dredge. Oh my gosh, just because we like brought a generator and everything. To... That trash pump. Yeah. I was like serious gold panning. What this is? What? This is our gold pan anniversary. Oh Lord. <laughs> One of these rocks and dig in there. You want to move a big rock? Yeah, maybe. Okay. You need help? Oh, too high. Huh? Too high. Water's too high. Go over my knee. Oh. <laughs> too high. Bring it flat. This rock moves. <laughs> <laughs> you want to move a rock? You can move this rock. setting up our sluice box. Oh. This guy's kind of the middleman of our process. Once I get it all set up, I'll show everybody how everything works. Okay, now our first step when we're in gold panning is we're gonna find a spot where we think the gold is. We're gonna dig a little bit up and we're gonna do a test pan. That's what you guys saw just a minute ago where we got those three little pieces of gold. That was my first pan. Now I've decided I like this spot and I think there's stuff there. Now we need a bucket and a classifier. Fill this guy up with water. We don't have very many flat spots to set this guy up, do we? There we go. 
Now I got my classifier set up in the top of my bucket here. I'm gonna dig all my stuff up and throw it right in there. And it's gonna sift out the big stuff and then I can throw it away because I don't need that. Unless it's big gold. Unless it's big gold. <laughs> Don't die. I know all the rocks are wobbly. Oh, there's a big one. Look at that show. That's where the gold is right there. That's the one. I'm gonna wash some of that down in there. I'm gonna borrow your pan, baby. Now that my classifier is all filled up, I'm gonna shake it all around and make all that little stuff fall through. Don't fall over, Bucket. Don't fall over, Bucket. Oh, it's wobbly. There we go. All right, no more little stuff left. Check for big gold. Check for big gold. If only rocks were worth money. Right. Hey, rocks are worth money. We had to pay a whole lot of gravel for our driveway. <laughs> I don't need that. Now I keep doing that till my bucket's filled up and then we move on to the next step. Okay, I'll dump the water out, but don't dump out any of the rocks. That's the good stuff. Woo. All right, we're back at the sluice box. We're ready for our next step. We're gonna slowly dump this into the top of the sluice box, right where the little V-pan is, and let it all run through. Where is the gold gonna go? It's gonna go in the bottom, in the mat. Okay. Okay, and then after you get all that stuff put in this loose and you let all the light stuff get washed out of there, next you do your cleanup. We'll take everything on the inside of this and clean it all up into a bucket. Then we'll pan it and see how much gold's in it. everything down into my bucket.
Now it's time to look for the gold. Now the gold is the heaviest thing in the river, so if I agitate the water, the gold will settle to the bottom and all the light stuff will come to the top and then I can wash it off. One nice piece right in here. Yep, a couple pieces, that's about the reality of it, but we just do this for fun. Camera on it, so I can take credit for your gold. Is that it? Yeah. Yeah. What are you doing? Deep sea diving? Yeah. <laughs> Find all good stuff? Not yet. Not much black sand in this one. No. No, there's not a whole lot. I need a better bag. You better have a cost of the guy that gave you that shovel full of stuff. I know. I just <laughs> dust. Just gold dust in here. No nuggets in that one. No nuggets. No nuggets. I'm going to go. dead by the time we get home to put it in rice um, so fingers crossed for me if you I guess got to the video this far that means my phone survived because it has all the footage on it from this entire trip so the good news is we did think ahead and I brought two truck keys that way in case one key ends up in the river we had a second key so that means we can go start the truck and leave it running and lock it and then still have the other key with us. So that's good. So that maybe saved our bacon and my phone, I guess we'll see. Well, in other news, Mr. Reeve has the only bear gun on him. So uh, maybe I'll get eaten by a bear. That'll be new. You know, gotta try something new, right guys? Yay, I didn't get eaten by a bear. Yeah, you didn't get eaten by a bear. No, that's good. Guess how long my phone was in the water? How long? 20 seconds. How do you know that? Because I watched it because it was on this camera was was watching me. It was dance. actually videoing? Yeah! Ha <laughs> ha! Cool, huh? What did it look like? Sad. All I thought was is, oh my gosh, one Mississippi, two Mississippi, three Mississippi, oh, four no. Mississippi. You saw like, it fall in there? Yeah, yeah, and then you rescued it oh, like no. 21 seconds later or something like that. I'm like, oh, dang it. <sighs> we'll see. <laughs> Time to get a new phone. Wah, wah. Wah, wah. Mm -hmm. Well, at least you killed the phone in front of the other camera, so it'll make good footage. Yeah, I guess. Yeah. At least, let's just hope that's the only casualty, okay? Yes, let's yeah. hope. Yeah. What did we lose last time? Gold what do you mean? Fan. What do you mean? Did we lose a gold fan last time? Yeah, remember? When they shot down the sluice box? With oh, them. that's right. When it hit the log and sprayed you in the face. And... <laughs> yeah, it was like ricochet. Awesome. <laughs> that's 60 gallons a minute. Right. Well, the feeling has finally come back into my feet and they are cold. <laughs> so Mr. Reeve is going to finish um, running that last bucket through the sluice box. He'll pan that out and I guess we'll see if we got enough gold to buy me a new phone. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Oh, 
Hi. You sure you want to bring my phone up above the water too? Yeah. I promise <laughs> I won't drop it. I'll hold it with two hands. Okay. All right, I put all of the leftover little concentrated black sand into one pan. This is going to be everything that we got for the day. Let's see how we did, dude. Okay, here's the reveal. Oh, That's yeah, cool. look at that. So wow. Like they're all the way on the left. Yep. Awesome. My boots have never been cleaner. Yeah. Happy anniversary, honey. Happy anniversary to you, love. Mm.